Hi there, it's Shell. And today I'm just going to kind of show you guys what I received in the mail. Uh, so I'm going to call this Happy Mail because it made me happy. <laughs> this is from Louisa, or Louise, sorry. Uh, from Louise, and she is in Albuquerque. She's one of my subbies, and she asked me if I would like to trade journals with her. So the deal was she sends me a journal. If I like it, and we'll see if I like it or not, then I make one and send one to her. So, you know, who could lose at something like that? <laughs> and she's practically a neighbor. I mean, you know, Albuquerque is only five hours away. So anyways, what she did is she had this all wrapped up with packing tape. And I didn't want to cut anything, so I took that packing tape off. And it kind of reminded me, Louise, of... One of those um, fun packages that you wrap tons of tape on and to annoy your cousins and stuff in at Christmas time. <laughs> Clint's like, what in, what are you doing? But it was so fun. It's just a fun package. It was fun opening it and taking all that tape off. I just had fun. So it's definitely happy now. So I didn't open anything and I didn't want to go through anything until... I could share with you guys so just been that kind of day it's been a long day already and I'm tired and I just woke up from my nap <laughs> so let's check this out uh, is that a squirrel <laughs> first thing I see is a squirrel and you guys know that is if I had a spirit animal that would be my spirit animal <laughs> I love squirrels how cute Louise this is adorable and what she did is she put like a really cute it's kind of like a is that a leopard print and did pinking shears around it oh how fun and she has some fun papers in here I knew I would love it because you know what I really love anything that um, I like to see how creative people are so there's really nothing that I don't like especially if it's something you made for me so I knew I would love it Louise <laughs> so that's a little hiding spot in there there's a little oh it actually opens this way I always cut mine down here and then fold it up I never thought about opening it from the side Look at that paper. That is so pretty. It's kind of like a, maybe a watercolor or something. That is really pretty. Green is my one of my favorite colors. My other favorite color is purple. And I knew I couldn't lose. <laughs> I just love, you know, I love everything. I'm not sure what that is, but it, it almost feels like suede. Some kind of paint or something. That's cool. How fun. It's just like a little notebook or something. I can pop it in my purse and take notes or, you know, jot down little ideas. Here's the middle of the signature. Very sweet. I love angels. I love it, Louise, and I haven't even got into the rest of it. <laughs> you know what? It's just... Wow. I don't know. That is just so cool. You have to let me know what that is. So, I've just been having so much fun today. I did my taxes finally. It took me like four hours to get our taxes ready and you know we don't actually do our taxes we just get them ready for the CPA and it took me like four hours and by then my brain I was kind of like brain dead <laughs> it's like my brain was like I don't want to do anything else so I took a nap <laughs> actually I mailed some Etsy packages and then I took a nap and I'm just tired from yesterday and everything so, I thought the best kind of video for you guys for today, because it's Monday, but you'll see this on Tuesday, is to do a fun Happy Mail video. 
kind of just relaxing for me and sharing, you know, for you guys. That is so pretty, Louise. I love that. And look at all the green. Love. <laughs> okay. Holy cow, girl. <laughs> I was expecting like one journal, maybe like this. You know, I didn't know what to expect because you said you'd send me something first. But, oh, it's just beautiful. Another little kind of notebook. And I love, you know, like journaling and stuff. For this one, well, she sewed down the spine and then she put this really pretty ribbon. Beautiful, Louise. And then this looks like a piece of... There's kind of batting in here, so maybe a piece of a quilt or something. That is so pretty, and the really pretty buttons. She binded, binded. She bound this with the uh, red seam binding. Look at that. Wow, I love that. Wow, what a treasure. Just beautiful. Uh, I'm not sure if Louise has a uh, YouTube page, but I'll talk to her and find out. And if she does, I'll leave it in the uh, definition of this, the description of this video. <laughs> guys, we're getting flies now. So what you hear in the background is one of my guys hunting. And these guys are such good hunters. We never have... Um, flies, which is wonderful. <laughs> Look at that. It looks kind of like coffee dyed, but something else, like ink or something. So I heard the fly over there earlier, and somebody finally kind of ran over there. Oh, self improvement. <laughs> I love this. This is awesome. Just your papers and stuff are just beautiful. And again, like I said, I'm not sure if she has an Etsy shop either, as well as a YouTube shop. Or a YouTube page. But if she does, I will link them in the description below. Sorry, my cat kind of distracted me, but you guys know how I am. <laughs> wow. How fun. These are just so fun. Okay, let's look at the next one. Wow. <laughs> I totally feel spoiled. Look at that. That is beautiful. Kind of like a... Um... Ooh, look at that. Isn't that just stunning? It's kind of like a quilted or a tapestry almost. Hi. <laughs> uh, There's Clint. Uh, 375, I think. I don't have any carrots or anything. I'm just roasting right now. Yeah, I that's what I would do. Them. Sorry, we got some turkeys. We got five turkey breasts with the bone in the other day, and Clint's deboning them, and we roast up the bones for uh, turkey broth. So that's what he's doing now. He's taking all the meat off. He does all the gross stuff with the meat. And then I'll do the broth and stuff later. But he's getting them in the oven. Look at the tapestry. Isn't that pretty? But five turkey breasts takes up a lot of room in your refrigerator. Three down. Three down. He's got two more to go. <laughs> but they were like 97 cents a pound. And you know you just can't really pass up a seven pound turkey that is normally $19. And you get it for $7. So you kind of have to get it when you can so he's going to grind up all this turkey meat for us wow this is beautiful a thank you card fighting osteoporosis and promoting bone health that's beautiful the flowers and stuff and I love that it's so open I mean there's plenty of place to to do look at the cover oh wow is that from 
This is from Louise in Albuquerque. Wow, it's beautiful, Louise. All these are from her. Wow, it's a, that <laughs> that's incredible. You did a beautiful job. <laughs> Look, I can write a list. <laughs> oh, hot dog. <laughs> How beautiful. I love these papers. It's just so fun. Yeah, Louise, I'll be sending you something in the mail shortly. You have to give me a little bit of time, but I love it that much that I'm definitely going to mail you a package. <laughs> Remember, that was her stipulation. If you don't like it, you can just keep it. You don't have to send me anything else. But how could you not just love this? I mean, it's just awesome. I love the... This is, would be cool. This journal kind of has like that um, feel of like a garden journal. So that would be really fun to keep track of uh, our garden and stuff. Just little notes and things that I want to keep track of in here. So these, you know, I would say they're kind of like a TN, which is a um, traveler's notebook. But, isn't that what a TN stands for? Yeah, I think it is. Uh, but they're not as tall. But they're so fun. They're perfect for little notes and things. And then look at this one. <laughs> that is so cool. I love this fabric. It's kind of like a um, canvas. And then she kind of stitched around it. That is awesome. I can't read anything on it. Oh, look at this. Little butterflies. Oh, wow. How beautiful. She put some little um, cards. I forgot what they're called. You guys know what they're called, right? A little envelope. Oh, look at that. Looks like it's glued shut, but I can fix that. Look at those colors. Isn't that just beautiful? Wow. I want to come play with you. <laughs> this is kind of like a burlap material with the chevron print. She included a pen, so this is like another notebook that you kind of take take with you maybe. Or, you know what, it could be perfectly for like pictures, like maybe a little brag book. I should take pictures of all my cats and put in here. <laughs> <laughs> wonder if there's enough room <laughs> just a fun little notebook so she did you know just like some cardstock and then it's just empty I mean blank cardstock in here so you could use it as an art journal I could do little pictures or something that's probably what I'll do because you know I have enough pictures of my cats <laughs> but how beautiful lessons learned Wow. But I think you kind of mislabeled our <laughs> our trade because you said a journal and here's four. <laughs> Let's see. This looks like a bunch of goodies that I can play with. Starting with the bag. You guys know I'll use that. Let's see what else she has. This is so funny. You know, for so many years we would use the quarter rolls and now they're considered vintage <laughs> I actually found a bunch of these when I was cleaning out my um, shed look at this it's like a little um, basket how fun sorry I had to see how you did that <laughs> that is so pretty oh and it's a little coin envelope oh Okay, Louise, I just am in love with this. Wow. And it gives me some ideas of something to send back to you. So, I'm kind of excited now to do that. I, f I can't remember what these are called. Um, memory card? No, I don't know. It'll come to me probably as soon as I turn off the... Um, camera. Here's a little kite sticker it looks like and a little bookmark. 
And this is just like a little pocket that she, it's two different sheets of paper. This is just a square or a rectangle. And then she sewed on this cute little square. Um, that's one thing that's so fun about swapping with people or having exchanges is you kind of see what they do, you know, how they get ideas from them. That's what I like. And it's really, you know, it's not, you know, something I would do. I mean, it's, it's beautiful, but, you know, if I, mine would be totally different. You know, like somebody said, if you gave us all the same paper, we'd all come up with something different. And I think that's the fun thing of getting, you know, swaps and stuff with that really pretty die cut. Hmm. That is gorgeous. I just love everything, Louise. This is like, oh, check this out. She took a book page, and it's kind of like a little poem on it. And then, oh, and it's on an envelope. <laughs> she has a few things inside the envelope. Some goodies. But see what I mean? I mean, you, it's stuff that I would never think of. There's a little paper in here. I didn't see a card or anything. I was just double checking <laughs> that I didn't miss anything. Here it is. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Louise. This is beautiful. Look at that. How fun. So she kind of did like a collage on the front and then made this fun little pocket out of a book page. And there's all kinds of little tuck spots. And then it's an envelope that you can tuck into. That is lovely, uh, Louise. I may have to kind of steal that idea. <laughs> or shall I say, shellify it. <laughs> that is awesome. Look at this. Just a little decoration. This is another kind of pocket. She stapled on it, which I love the staples. That is so sweet. Awesome ideas. There's a car. That is a Porsche 911. Wow. I used to own one of those. I'm kidding. I did not. <laughs> this is... feels like there's something in it. But I don't think there is. Nope. It's like a drawing maybe, or a stamp that she colored. Wow. <laughs> Another, I really love how you did that. You could also put like a little tag there to kind of pull out or something. Things I wish you'd do. <laughs> mm. The Morning Warbler. Oh, how cute. Just like a little note pad. Kind of just a single kind of note thing. Thank you so much, Louise. I love this. I feel totally spoiled today. <laughs> wow. This went above and beyond anything I could have imagined. Look how sweet this is. But I'm not sure it qualifies as one journal. <laughs> very many beautiful pages in here thank you so much and you will be uh, receiving something from me in the near future so when I went down I had ordered something from Russia and it came today as well you know I was kind of thinking when's it gonna get here and I know you know leave it some time for sure but this is something that I ordered, and I ordered it from June's Journals on Etsy, and I learned of this lady um, by watching Diane Hubert. She had got one of these journals, and it was so stunning. So, I kind of had to use some money that I <laughs> recently received from some of my journals to get this one. 
and I am so excited to see what it looks like. Because, you know, I did watch the video a couple of times, I must say. And because I was so enthralled with this. And so while I was killing time, you know, for it to get here. <laughs> Waiting is sometimes the hardest part. So, kind of. So it says, don't let it get you down. It will be over soon. It will be over with soon. Isn't that the truth, you know? A lot of times, you know, I know, I know I've mentioned this before, but, you know, you have one thing through the day, and it just depresses you for a day or for a week, and, you know, we shouldn't let it get to us, you know, and stay with us that long, I guess. Beautiful flowers. But, yeah, I will put her link below. Uh, she is from Russia, and... She has some absolutely beautiful items. I'm trying to figure out what, how that goes in there. <laughs> that is so gorgeous. And you guys know we're fixing to do butterflies. Here's a beautiful rose. Just a little. But I was so amazed. And I really liked it because in her, um, I think that's her about page. She says that her and her husband make these journals together and it kind of reminded me of Clint and myself you know so I was so excited to get this and you know because Clint helps me out a lot in my journals look at that adorable little doll <laughs> there you go sorry and it was just so pretty tons of mushrooms little umbrella just beautiful little ephemera that I can use. Oh, look. Butterfly. Here's some bees. I have some gorgeous pictures of bees and butterflies that I'm going to dig out. See if I can't do some kind of digital with it and maybe um, use that in some of my butterfly books or book. So pretty. Hope you guys don't... Oh. A nut. <laughs> nut. <laughs> oh. So I have to tell you guys, one, of, um, one year at Christmas time, my sister and I, we always, we have this thing that um, squirrels and nuts mean something special, something secretive kind of to us. And, you know, it has to do with family and stuff. But anyways, it's just a fun Thing, so we're always calling each other nuts and squirrels and stuff like that and one year for Christmas she seriously gave me 17 items that had squirrels or nuts on it <laughs> 17 so I thought it was so funny can't tell if these are stickers they're kind of stick um, kind of glossy on this side and vellum kind of on the other side so I may have to look into that. They kind of look like they might be stickers. But yeah, that's the most squirrels and nuts in one <laughs> item. So, so far I've got squirrels and nuts in these packages. <laughs> but So we always laugh, you know, whenever we... Because we look... I look for squirrels and nuts all year long for her. And she does the same thing for me, so... Okay, so let's just some bubble wrap. I did bring out my scissors, but like I said, I hope you guys don't mind, you know, watching these kind of videos. I love to see what others, other people have and learn about new creators and stuff like that. And, you know, um, after doing our taxes today, and I know I shouldn't have put it off this long, but, you know, I just didn't feel creative. And when I went and picked up nail, I was so excited that I could just show you guys these gorgeous journals that came in the mail. And let you kind of um, enjoy them with me. So, this one absolutely took my breath away. And... But look at this. Once you put that in that little bag, I'm going to keep it. 
Oh, oh, I haven't even looked at it yet. So this is about, what, six inches by probably four and a half or so. And it's stunning. Absolutely stunning. And look at that. It's got five signatures. Isn't that gorgeous? I love that outside. That's pretty. It's beautiful. And I haven't really purchased any journals. I think I've got one or two that I have. I have one from Gail Agustinelli that I actually won in a giveaway. And then I have one from Cindy Miller, I think. And she does these really funny um, rabbit kind of journal type things. And I ordered hers. Got that for myself for my birthday last year. And then I was looking for something online. And I saw Miss Diane. And Diane Hubert, her channel is below. I always have it and my people who inspire me listed below so if you want to go check her out but definitely go check out june's journals on etsy uh, i think they're acorn squash oh. so i got this as a way to kind of um and she does have a full flip through on her channel and i will link that below as well i can't remember if it's named the same thing or not but we're going to go through it anyways. <laughs> I could send you over there to look at it. And she probably has a more detailed than what I will do. But definitely go check out her things. But this is a tuck spot. And then she has this kind of not lined up perfectly. And that's a tuck spot. And I thought that was really cool. Some gorgeous papers. Isn't that pretty? I mean just stunning I was so in love with this and look at this so she kind of used the thing the um, cut out and then you can kind of see behind it which I thought was so fun looks like some coffee dyed paper maybe I don't know and then this one she has the same kind of thing but isn't that fun? You know, I just think it's, like I said, I love learning new things from other people. She put some flowers over here. This, I believe, is like a belly band. I don't know if that is going to be long enough. Yeah, it's a belly band. Beautiful maple leaf on it. And I loved all the green and just the kind of fall colors pocket there and I've been so excited to get this you know you see something on um, video but it doesn't have anything to do you know doesn't compare anything to real life it's just amazing and I love how she did like catty corner pockets and you know nothing is precise but isn't that absolutely gorgeous little note card here's a frame and then this is kind of fun she has you know the kind of cattywampus little pocket there some gorgeous stuff oh and look this look at this I th think this is something I might have to borrow look at that yes. how it kind of has things you can write in there and you can kind of yeah. um, hide it or adjust it you guys know I love like hidden pocket spots <laughs> things like that beautiful uh, looks like a clear yeah like a vellum page that I can color on looks like coffee dyed paper absolutely stunning sorry pulling it to me so you guys can't see it <laughs> so but isn't that fun how she did the kind of cutouts and stuff? I think that is so inventive, so creative. Just beautiful. And I got this with the intent of, you know, using it for our garden this year. But we'll see because I really like that one um, little kind of handheld journal that uh, Louise just gave me. And I really like that. So that might 
take the place of this one, which is fine because I can always find something else. Here's a little tuck spot too. But oh, I just am so in love with this. I knew I would love it as soon as I saw it. It was like, and somebody else, or two or three other people already had it in their cart. And, you know, I wanted to talk to Clint before I purchased, purchased it because it wasn't cheap. But, I mean, totally worth what I paid for it. And he's like, just get it. <laughs> But, and he fell in love with it too. He was just like enthralled by the beauty that's in here. Oh, and look at the butterfly. It has the open weave. But yeah, be sure and go over and check out her. Absolutely stunning. Another tuck spot. You can tell. I mean, like every page seems to have sewing on it. I mean, they take some time and some care to create here. This actually has holes in it, it looks like. Yeah, kind of peeks through there. That's kind of cute. Some more kind of coffee dyed paper. But isn't that fun? Oh, I don't know if I saw this. It's kind of, it's just a, a little booklet with some coffee dyed paper in there so special but isn't that just adorable I am so in love with this so June if you're watching <laughs> I think she said her name was June or was something else but she goes by June because she's in Russia but I'm not 100% sure so don't quote me on that <laughs> There's another open weave, kind of. I mean, just absolutely stunning, beautifully done. Definitely worth every penny, that's for sure. True artist. But look at that, isn't that beautiful? So fun. Oh, this is an actual tag. <laughs> so, I have to put her name and stuff inside here. Because I do want to be able to refer back to them. And as well as the other one. Refer back to them and, you know, say, oh, so-and-so made this for me. And things like that. So, I can make sure I always give credit to whoever sent me the journal. So, thank you so much. For uh, June and for Louise, I am in love with everything. It's just absolutely amazing. I had a fun day with mail today. And, you know, sometimes it's just nice not to get a bunch of bills, which we got bills too. But <laughs> this is the fun stuff. So, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed these type of videos. If you do, be sure and give me a big thumbs up. Uh, be sure and subscribe. I will be back tomorrow with more tutorials. I just needed a short break, but I still wanted to put something out there so you guys could kind of enjoy looking at these goodies with me. So thank you guys so much for watching. We will see you in the near future. So be sure and hit that subscribe button and we'll see you soon. You guys have a wonderful day. Have a good day.